Hello, dog fighting tubers, and welcome back to Let's Play Wing Commander The Secret Missions with me, Blue Ankylo. We're in Jotunheim and we're on our third mission today. Uh, no one's no one's in the bar, so I'm assuming they're either dead or we're under attack or something. So let's see how it goes. This is a kind of a weird mission, and uh, there's a lot of enemy fighters, so this this might be too much for me. But we'll see what happens. Hey Blue, bar's closed. The colonel needs every pilot in briefing right away. Well, that stuff that that covers that. We're we're not allowed to drink. We are also recently promoted. Captain Ankylo reporting for duty. Hundred over a hundred kills. Pretty awesome. That's how you get your promotions. It's very important. Mission briefing. Sometimes. Quiet, everyone. We have an emergency situation here. We've received a distress call from the Johan, an extra class ship, that was attacked by the Kilrathi several hours ago. They've drifted right into Kilrathi territory. I need someone to guard them while they complete enough repairs so they can reach the Tiger's Claw. Unfortunately, I also need most of you here to protect the Claw from another ambush. Blue and I can take care of the situation, Colonel. Good. Here's your mission. You'll launch immediately and go to Nav 1. If the Johan has drifted past that point, intercept them at Nav 2. Defend them from any Kilrathi in the area while they repair their ship. And then escort them back to the Tiger's Claw. The Colonel assigns the other wings to different patrols. That's all, pilots. Prepare for launch. Oh, good. Uh, an escort slash defense mission. Everyone's favorite. Well, looks like we're going to have a bad time if I have to actually protect an Exeter. You get to see some Exeter stats on the left of your screen every now and then if you pay close attention. At least we're in a Raptor, right? Alright, Nav 1, let's go. Okay, here we go. Gratha. Four Gratha. I feel like I hit the first one at least. That's got to count for something. And then here come the missiles. And here come more missiles. Before I have a chance for my shields to recharge. So we're going to do a little bit of ducking and weaving up and down and left and right. Trying not to lose all of our shields for no good reason. There we go. Alright, let's, let's mix it up again. Hopefully, Spirit's still alive. I really was planning on, like, sending a, a missile out. At least, at least we returned the favor, right? Come on, none of those hits? What a shame. What a sham! Alright, so the, the, the Gratha here are doing what they always do, where they surround you. And then always, like, focus fire no matter what direction you move. Uh, optimally, we really need Spirit to, like, keep one or two of them busy. Because I can't really focus on anything here. Clearly. And apparently I'm fighting like a stillborn kitten. That's what I always wanted to hear. A little bit of damage there, at least. I know I'm burning through a lot of fuel, but 4 Gratha is... Definitely on the high end of survivable without some fancy flying. Now, we haven't taken a whole lot of armor damage yet, but we've taken a little. We're at that point where we can't really fire our guns either, so that's that's fun. Oh good, Spirit killed one! Well, that's not bad. You know, that almost makes up for all the ramming she did before. Alright, come on. Oh yeah, that's a good one. I'll even take a missile for that. I did lose. We got two missiles. Look, I said one. Oh, goodbye all of our rear armor, because Gratha's spam missiles. The first one only did shield damage. The second one's what actually hurt. Don't fly in the way. I could do every sort of... Uh, Angle shot like that, we would be laughing. 
Maybe that's what you're supposed to be good at by now. Like, maybe you're supposed to be able to get those... You call them deflection shots in dogfighting school or something, I think? When you're coming in at weird angles and you're kind of aiming in front of them where they will be. I don't know. I'm obviously not a fighter pilot. I'm a terrible... I don't know what you want to call it. I'm a, I'm a terrible space pilot that kills his wingman and never escorts a Draymond. <laughs> Alright, four Gratha done. I think I used a missile or two. Now we get Jalthy. Even better! Don't fly in front of me. Now I appreciate your help, Spirit, but I think I've got this one. Maybe not. Guns, guns stopped working, so <laughs> as soon as the gun stopped working, uh, the Jalthy tore me to shreds. And apparently, Spirit's not doing a whole lot better. I mean, I killed one almost instantly. That's got to count for something. Yeah, that was a good shot. Oh. Oh. One shot from the Jalthy and I'm I'm dying. Oh, this is not this does not bode well, guys. Even though I killed the first one super fast. All right, they're probably gonna kill Spirit here if I don't do something. Alright, that was good volley there. Oh, okay, so do we send her home now? Let's finish this guy off and we'll check her ship out, see how she's looking. Uh, I'm not sure even what hit me that time. I don't think we crashed. Either Spirit shot me or... I don't know. Mystery. Anyway, that's that. How you doing, Spirit? Ah, oh, she's definitely not looking too hot. Well, she just crashed into me, didn't she? I don't have the armor for this. At least I wasn't moving much. All right, Spirit, just go home. Oh boy, I sure hope there isn't anything else too crazy out here. That was four Gratha and four Jalthy. We're, uh... Looking at my list over on the side, we're not even halfway through this mission. <laughs> Frick. This mission is nuts. I sure hope you know how to dogfight. I, that's why I, I gave you that hint when we opened up. So what do we get this time? Rapiers? What? Rapiers? They're not supposed to be enemies. So if you listen real close um, to some of the background, um, remember the tale about the Guinevar? Come on, I need to kill one right now. I don't have time to mess around. Uh, apparently an Exeter got captured that had, uh, apparently a, a complement of ships on it. Well, we're already dead. <laughs> so much for that. The, <laughs> the Guinevar, turns out, was actually the ship that was faking a distress call. You barely got a chance to see them, but yeah. Oh, two wings of rapiers. The, f the pure challenge of which one is superior, one raptor or four rapiers. We get to find out today, guys. All right. I just got to get good. So I really shouldn't use my missiles too much on the first two wings because I need them for the rapiers. The rapiers are... Well, I mean, you know what rapier stats looks like. Great start. Who needs shields? Who needs who needs shields? And you got missiles. All right. Goodbye, all my front shields again. So you know, I just I feel like I can't take so much armor damage here against the first wing of Grathas. Spirit's already dead. Well, forget this mission. We've already lost. I think you have to get lucky enough that on your first pass, you kill one. Or else, you're just doomed. I'm just spamming missiles again. Alright, we'll try to save her. Come on. That was a pretty good 
deflection. Or whatever you want to call it in space. I don't know if... Does it actually count as a deflection in space? I don't know. Still a pretty good angle shot one way or the other. Alright. Good. One to go. One down, three to go. Uh, if this one wants to fly in front of me, let's take the shots. Oh, he's still alive! I thought that would kill him! He's almost dead. He's almost dead. Gotcha! Alright. This has gone much better than the first time. Well, not for spirit, per se, but... And then suddenly I'm dead. Like, all my right armor's gone. And they're just shooting the crap out of me like crazy every time I blink. I should never say anything. Oh, looks like things are going better. Psh, exploded. So yeah, this this mission is probably the real test for your... What the frick? Spirit, are you doing anything? There's two Gratha. Keep one busy, and I will deal with the other one in like 10 seconds. I feel like she is not very helpful right now. She was more useful last mission where she was killing selfies at least. <laughs> She's good enough to kill a selfie, but not good enough to kill a Gratha. I guess she killed one, right? The first time? Alright, let's take stock here in a second. Alright, my ship is okay. Right armor gone, back armor damage, no internal damage. Spirit is also once again nearly dead. Well, I'm not sending her back. I need some help, clearly. I can't handle four rapiers alone. Let alone four Jalthies. Like, hope you like laser fire. This is like, this is rude. Oh look, a missile. Well, goodbye shields. And another another missile. And also a million lasers. Now, not a million, to be fair, I'm exaggerating a little bit. Only 24. Right? Only 24 at a time. Shields are... Guns are not recharging very quickly there. Good shot. As long as I'm not getting killed right now from behind, I can finish this one off. Alright, that's one fairly clean Jalthy death. This one's probably trying... Is she dead now? Wow! What an angle shot on their part there. I was not even flying towards them and he just smoked me. I guess if I can do angle shots, so can they. Almost feels well. No, I was gonna say it feels like my blaster, my my generator was going down. I wasn't charging up as quick as I used to. But so I'm pretty sure Spirit's dead. Uh, whether or not I'll be joining her soon is up for debate. At least we clipped him. Oop. I don't like how fast Jelthies can shoot. It feels like they don't even have energy concerns. Like if I had six guns on my ship, I could not just constantly fire them like that. Even just firing four at a time, you know, I can do three shots and then I gotta wait a few seconds. I mean, sometimes three shots all it takes. <laughs> it is, it's kind of like Jalthy versus Jalthy fighting, except that they can just hold the button down forever. I assume the uh, the enemy ships don't have to worry about energy management. Probably. I mean, I don't know for sure, but... Just got a hunch. Okay. Well. Phase 2. Still no internal damage. Uh, Spirit didn't make it, I don't think. 
Uh, we'll give it a try against the rapiers again. I wonder how many tries this mission is going to take us. <laughs> I think technically you're probably supposed to see the rapiers and then run home as soon as they attack you. <laughs> but uh, we're not going to leave that conquered or captured... Uh, a captured confederation exeter sounds like a bad thing to leave. I'm also pretty sure that one triple volley of uh, full guns here can kill a rapier. They're really not as tanky as uh, a Gratha. But they've obviously got a lot of guns and a lot of missiles. And I should really be using my missiles. Boy, here it goes. At least I killed one right away. Man, if those would hit, that'd be beautiful. We're trying to do some cool jousts. No, I don't want to go for the Exeter. That's foolish. Oh, this guy's almost dead. Oh, there wasn't so many of them and so many missiles. I have actually almost killed a second one. It's a little bit hard also. Um... Because I'm not used to fighting rapiers, so I'm not sure which direction they're facing. So it's a little bit... Crazy. <laughs> Look! There's like 50 missiles coming at me. I'm just in one little raptor against a million of these jerks. This is the one we need to kill. Please kill it. Uh, I think it... I think we got it. It died! Okay. We're down to... Three? Was there five of them? Cheaters. You're not supposed to have five ships. It's supposed to be a, a, a group of four. Oh, so much damage. Shield generator. Oh, we're screwed. Crap. We were fine until they hit my shield generator. But now I can't even take a single missile without losing armor. I'm burning all my afterburner fuel so I don't take that missile. And I... Well, it actually didn't kill me, so... Okay. Interestingly, both of the rapiers that were following me have taken some damage. Unfortunately, they still have a million missiles. I've got, uh... I actually don't know if friend or foe will even work here. I've got two. I'll try. And they fired another 50 missiles. I think I hit them with something. I don't know if they hit themselves or what exactly happened there. Alright, we got another one. It's looking a little bit better here. Come on. Come on, old blue. This is cats flying rapiers. Cheating cats. Where is it? Where is he? Ooh, that was a big hit. That was a big hit. Remember, they got the they got the big guns on rapiers. They got neutron blasters or whatever they're called. Oh, they got me good there. Come on, finish him. Finish him. Shoot! The other one's right on my tail. So I have to keep boosting around like a maniac. I know I'm almost out of jets. Come on, this thing's dead. All right, one to one. All right. This one's also injured a little bit. Ah, oh, come on. No, don't crash. Oh, man, there goes all my guns, or at least some of them. God, this is not working out so well. See, they're more agile than me for the first time ever. Come on. Come on. Come at me. Is it, is it fleeing? Damn it! <laughs> oh no, it's coming back, it's coming back. So one one of the perks of having only two guns is you kind of get rapid fire. Okay, let's just take a breather. Holy smokes. The sad thing is there's still eight more enemies to kill, but I can't kill them now. There's no way. The good news is we can clean up the Exeter. I don't think the Exeter actually gets any weapons. 
right? If I get shot, I'm in trouble, but... We almost killed it in one wave, I think. And yeah. So this... This is the captured Guinevar. It's pretty tanky. You gotta give it credit. But, uh... It might be stronger than a Frouthy in terms of armor, but... Yeah, it's taking a beating. There we go! You can see there was a cat. There was a cat inside it all along. So the problem I have is I have to get home. And I don't have any fuel. And it's not going to be so simple. Because it's an ambush. And it's Krantz. And even if I win this battle against the Krantz, um, I think we're dead. I'm trying to space my jets out a little bit to get as far as possible. But, uh... Like, that's it. I think that's my last jet. Maybe there. Oh, I'm running on fumes! Tiger's Claw saved me! <laughs> so, in case you're wondering, there was four Krantz, and then if we won that, there'd be four more Grathas. I could not defeat four more Grathas. Maybe the four Krantz if I was lucky. But no, I didn't have enough fuel left to kill, to, to dodge the missiles. So I think we had to run away there. The main thing is we uh, blew up the Guinevere and stopped them from sending out fake distress calls. So we accomplished our mission, although we left a few fighters out there. I don't know how you could kill all that. You have to kill four Gratha, four Jalfi, four Rapiers, four more Krantz, and four more Grathas to win that. That's eight Gratha, four Jalthi, four Frat Krantz, and four Rapiers. The Rapiers are, well, they're almost Gratha tier for in terms of the amount of spammy missiles they do. Mission debriefing, 113. I'm very curious to hear your report, Blue. Where is the Johan? Why in the hell didn't you bring it back? Well, sir. It wasn't the Johan waiting for us at Nav 2, sir. It was the Guinevar. The Guinevar? I never thought that story was for real. What happened, Ankylo? It was real, sir. It tried to kill us. But it's dusted now. Well, here's your recorder information. You had 14 kills, Blue. And Spirit did basically nothing. Alright, take it easy for a while. Dismissed. So, <laughs> yeah. Technically, that was a victory. Although, we could have got 8 more kills if you really want to rack up your kill counter, but... Man, you you gotta be real good to take on everything on that mission and not just run home. I don't know. I don't know. The last four Gratha, I just don't know how I could have enough left for that. Enough in the tank. Maybe if, if uh, Spirit was flying better. Congratulations, you get a Bronze Star. You actually get this, uh... Anyway, I think this mission is like an automatic Bronze Star, as long as you land your ship. Uh, like I said, there's not even, even, I don't think there's even any victory points on this mission. You just, you're just supposed to learn that the Guinevar was out there and probably run home. Technically, we destroyed it, so that's about as good as you can do. Unless you're a friggin' genius. Well done, sir. Thank you. I mean, well done, kid. I don't, whatever. Hey. I'm a little bit frazzled. That was a lot of, a lot of ducking and rolling. But that's it. We survived. Technically, we may have died once, but second time was good, right? Or was that the third time? I don't know how many times. That was probably just twice. Uh, I actually don't know... Where are we? Where are we? We're in the Bifrost system. That's probably good. Alright, so. What'd you guys think of that? That was a crazy mission, guys. Um, I've been trying to be, you know, thorough as a general rule. To not just skip out on missions and, and not show all the content. And generally trying to go for the maximum, you know, completionist sort of strat where you see all the enemies and you you kill everything because you're an ace. But uh, that mission, man, I, I have tried it before and it's just... Getting every single kill on that one is just so hard. It takes a lot of luck. You know, if, if, you're, if your wingmate helps out, you know, lures some enemies away while, while maybe shooting a couple of missiles at them at least... And then you can finish them off quick. Uh, I'm sure you can do it. It's just... It takes a little bit of luck for, for Spirit being useful. And 
Also getting some good opening salvos, like pretty much any time it's 4v1, you've almost definitely need to open with one kill as you fly by. If you can pull that off, 3 to 1, maybe get in behind one quick before they can really send too many missiles at you. Suddenly you're down to 2 to 1, and then you can just dodge missiles for a minute and start picking them off. But, uh, I just didn't have enough afterburner fuel to handle all the missiles, basically. Really, that's like the limiting factor a lot of the times. If I have enough fuel, I can try to continuously dodge as, as long as I've got fuel. But once we run out, uh, you're, you're toast. There's no way. Especially when you're fighting, what did I say... 8 Gratha, 4 Jelfi, 4 Krant, and 4 Rapiers. I think all of those have at least 3 heat-seeking missiles, if not more. Like, Gratha might even have 4, and the Rapiers have definitely 3 at least. Um, so if you have to dodge, what did I say? And the Jelfi have a few as well. That's 8, 12, 16, that's 20 fighters, even at 3 missiles each. That's potentially 60 missiles you'd have to dodge. If you can kill them quicker, you'd, you'd, you'd kill them before they use them, but... Man, that's that's too much. At least for flying raptors, you know, raptor can take one missile with full shields. But if they shoot four at a time, you're, you're screwed, basically, if you can't dodge them. And dodging them isn't as easy as you'd think. Like, I haven't really figured it out terribly well, obviously, but I try. I try to boost away and spin around them and stuff, but it's not so simple. Anyway, that's all for today's episode. Thanks for watching, folks. I hope you have enjoyed. And I'll see you next time for Bifrost. Sounds like we're... We're, we're, we're in Thor, right? Every, everything's named after Norse gods. We're, we're, we're in Valhalla. We must already be dead. Alright, folks. See you guys next time. Have a great day.